This is the climbing perch or Anabas testudinus, a native species of the Southeast Asia as well as Africa region. Climbing perch are also known as climbing goromi and taikoi is well recognized for their ability to climb out of water, hence the name climbing perch. This special ability can only be found in a handful of species like mudskippers, lungfish and walking catfish. These are the species that have been identified to be the first to crawl out of water and colonize land. In some culture, climbing perch is believed to possess mystical power, preventing black magic from entering the house. This belief stems from the ability to live on land without water for days, which then crown them as a special fish. Living in muddy freshwater is never been easier, especially when drought season and water dry out. As a matter of fact, climbing perch could breathe air and survive on land during drought season due to the presence of labyrinth organ, a lamella plates with thin bones that could absorb oxygen into the blood to be distributed to the body. This extra breathing accessory, which functions like a lung for them, aside from the true gill, is what makes them an exceptional survivor. But another question pop up. How do they walk? Before the evolution of tetrapods that walk by using four limbs, the walking fish like the climbing perch use their front pectoral fins together with actual pores from the tail and those spiny protrusions on their gill plates to push them forward. Hence, they kinda use only two limbs to move around, which is the pectoral fins instead of four in tetrapods and other terrestrial vertebrates. Climbing perch is one of a highly commercial value fish in the Asia region. They are intensively cultured for food and some even like them to be rare as pets. With the ability to live in low dissolved oxygen environment, this fish has been in demand in many countries. Being a carnivorous, they are cultivated to be a check and balance for small insects in ponds. In India, Bangladesh and Southeast Asia, they are commercially farmed as protein source. However, in certain countries like Australia, this species is considered invasive as they could eliminate their native species and currently, this fish is already walking towards the Queensland Island in Australia when enter the water body from Papua New Guinea. Scientists are concerned about the invasion of climbing perch in Australia as they could be harmful for the bird's population. There are reports that climbing perch could cause choking hazard to the native birds and other fish who try to eat them. This is caused due to their spiny gill cover when they flex them up and get caught down their throat. And surprisingly, there are also cases when children and men choke and die when the fish accidentally slip down their throat. What more interesting facts that you know about climbing perch? Share them in the comment section below. If you find this video interesting, consider to subscribe and click that bell button to receive updates from our YouTube channel. Until then, thank you for watching and see you next time.